Hello, brothers and sisters in Christ. Today is Monday, June 8th, and it's 9.17 a.m. And um, I have, to, you know, I've said this before. I think I do need to take a few days off, like this week. And I'm asking that you all don't send me any emails like for to see this video or that video unless it's something like we've been attacked by Russia <laughs> I mean in Seattle or something you know or uh, Hawaii or because I don't have TV I wouldn't know that and that is something I would appreciate knowing okay but to watch any more things about the riots George Floyd, uh, I mean, and I want to, if I feel like it, I want to get on and go to the channels I know and trust and see what they have to say and then get off. And if you have a prayer request, you email me as always, and I will be trying to keep an eye on comments and answer comments so if you want to leave a very important link in a comment that would be okay too I mean just you wouldn't believe how many I get an email watch this watch that um, and no subject nothing about it so all I can do is click on the link to see what it's about you know and one of the messages, another third time now, came through from Don's email that it's time to take a break, time to rest, rest and relaxation, or, or it said something like you're feeling weary and you can't do your best when you're feeling this way or something. The reason I, I've been hesitant about sharing more of the prophecies that people send is because I remembered that I had gotten a message a while back. I mean, we're talking a couple, three years ago. The Lord told me to stop sharing other people's prophecies on my channel. And perhaps it was because he knew how deceitful the enemy was. And maybe I didn't have enough discernment back then. So now I'm going to be in prayer about, Lord, I feel like I've grown to where I have more di dis um, discernment about what's from you and what's not. And can I start sharing the ones I feel are from you? So, I really want to be in more prayer and praise and worship than on the computer all the time, just watching videos that people send. And I enjoy your letters, I do. And sharing dreams or something that I can share, dreams or visions, because those are not the same as prophecies. We just have to be really careful about what we say is, thus saith the Lord. And uh, who we're telling that this is something from the Lord, you know. I hope you understand what I'm saying. I'm just, I am so tired. I know I probably don't look it or sound it. <laughs> That's just how it is. With MECFS, so your doctors think you look fine. There must not be anything wrong with you. <laughs> I don't know how we're supposed to look. <laughs> If they could be a fly on the wall, they could see. <laughs> but anyway, um, uh, 
Okay, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> okay, see, I want to do better. I do. I mean, that video I shared about Kathy, I was just all over the place, getting sidetracked. And um, when I did that video with the brochures, I should have made it a separate video so that only those who wanted to learn that could click on it. And then have it prepared, but I just decided, like, okay, why not do it right now? <laughs> and I didn't do it very well, so I probably just confused you all and thought, you know, you probably thought, oh, forget this. I can't ever do this. <laughs> anyway, I was just trying to say, this is just one thing you could do. <laughs> There's so many things we can do for the Lord, you know, to serve. To serve our church, the body of Christ. And a lot of it means stepping out of the body of Christ. Like when we're helping homeless. They're not all saved. They're not all brothers and sisters in Christ. But like Pastor Dave that I've asked for prayer for, he does. He helps the homeless. And he witnesses to them. I'm sure he gets them Bibles if they want them, but mainly he takes them supplies, and um, I don't know if they work in the soup kitchen. I don't know if they do that. I don't remember. But anyway, I'm just saying there's a lot of things you can do for the kingdom of God and to try to help, you know, spread the gospel, be a witness, be a light. Letting your light shine so others can see your good works and glorify your Father in heaven. That's a scripture. So if people never see you doing anything, what are they going to think? <laughs> He's no better than me. She's no better than me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. And I'm sorry. Uh, <laughs> anyway, so I'm going to get off of here and I'm just telling you. Um, I'll be back, <laughs> I'm sure of it, because the Lord has not told me to quit, just rest. <laughs> so, okay, with that I will say bye for now, but you will be in my prayers. And whatever I do do online uh, will be minimal, and if he does lead me to share something, I will. Otherwise, um, I won't. <laughs> I just got to draw closer to the Lord. Okay? All right. I love each and every one of you. I will be looking for your comments and prayer requests in email. Otherwise, they'll just probably get deleted. Okay. Um, that's all for now. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.